good morning everybody <laughs> welcome back to a new vlog i can't quite take myself seriously today it is the first vlog back of 2024 How, like i can't even believe i'm saying 2024 it feels very strange it also feels very strange because i haven't vlogged in what feels well i think it's been close to a month i had a really long christmas this year it was very needed you know wedding planning would not have happened without an extended break i was getting very behind over the course of november december that's not what we're going to be discussing today but thankfully we are getting there also i am super rusty today because i have had uh, oh my god this is running out because I have had an extended Christmas break, I feel so rusty in my speaking, which is kind of ironic because I've been recording new podcast episodes. So I'm questioning why I am currently unable to speak when that is actually what I have been doing whilst I've been having my YouTube break. I've still been speaking and having to be coherent, so I don't really know why I'm having such a problem right now. Let's call it first day back nerves, but today I am getting ready to leave the house. This is literally the only trip this month that I have allowed to be in my diary. And when we get there, you obviously see why it was a no brainer. But other than this trip, I'm literally not leaving the house. I'm not going anywhere. I have turned down some quite amazing things this month because I am just not up for going anywhere. I need to be nesting in my home, my lovely newly refurbished home we're back in if you haven't tuned in for a while. This is the upstairs guest bedroom which still like there's a lot of things that I really want to do in here but that will be for another year, a different budget. But we do have um, a new addition in here today of some chairs for my wardrobe room, closet, walk-in closet, whatever you want to call it. I need to come up with a fun name for it. It needs a rebrand because the Room of Doom, I can't keep calling it that because I actually think I manifest it being hideously chaotic. So we need to come up with a fun rebrand for that room. And if anyone has any suggestions, if you're like a marketing genius, one of those people that makes up all the fun like TikTok trends that are nothing new but constantly have a new name please hit me up with some suggestions for the room of doom's rebrand <laughs> but i have two chairs in here there's one here and there's one there which are going in there once there is space because right now it is flat pack hell there's a lot of ikea boxes in there we are building my temporary storage solution because the wedding has eaten my walk-in wardrobe budget entirely and i'm not mad about it i am not mad about it is the wedding a slightly less sensible way to spend my money yes have i fully taken that on the chin and know what i'm walking into also yes i chose this i'm not worrying about it i will deal with ikea storage for a year or two anyway i'm in my newly lovely finished guest room which we had various guests in over christmas and it was just lovely. We hosted New Year, which was a lot of fun. I have never seen my house such a mess after though. Like, we've never really thrown a party here. <laughs> there weren't, it wasn't even a big party. But anyway, my point being, the house is finally done. We had our last, like, little bit of, it's called snagging, where you go around and just, like, pick out all the bits that kind of need maybe a bit of a tweak or like there needs to be some like filler here or there or whatever. We had our last item on the snagging list sorted yesterday. So it is officially done and dusted and I just need to be in my house for a little bit and get everything in order because things are still quite crazy. My office is still looking very, very wild and not usable. The Room of Doom, new name TBC is crazy and just a mess. I still don't know where some of my clothes are so we need to get that sorted and all unpacked and then I also do need to just finish sorting out like my wardrobe downstairs. The We've got like more of a utility space where the staircase is now downstairs as well and that just needs like once everything else is sorted hopefully that will kind of start to sort itself as well and get all nice and organized but in order to do those things i really need to be home and i really want to be home so that is what we are going to be up to this month there's going to be a lot of home organizing however not today because i am off on a girly trip you will get more details when we arrive but i'm really looking forward to this one i'm also loving the fact that 
it is slightly more local to me. I think my journey will be the shortest, which never happens. I also, as you can see, have <laughs> popped my hair into rollers this morning. I have this new hair routine, which I'll maybe show you at some point if you want to see it in action. But I've basically been just curling the ends of my hair, so not even the whole way down just literally like the last two three inches two two inches of hair and then setting it like hairspraying it and setting it in rollers and fairly large rollers as well so that it gives a really gorgeous blowout look and it's really helping it to stay so i'm only really doing it like the once and then it stays the whole of the time like the, the whole rest of the week until i wash it and it's been a great new routine i mean tbc because sometimes i feel like you do a routine maybe a bit too much and then it almost stops working so i'm hoping this continues to work this will be the third or fourth time i've done it so today will be the ultimate test for whether it's actually going to stick oh my god this smells so good urban decay all nighter vitamin c cactus flower water mm. i stopped using this for a while and i've been missing it so much Ooh, i love using setting sprays by the way i've been loving taking a brush like this like really small kind of flat ish but not super flat and just tapping it in along my lash line just with like a dark kind of brown it's just really really flattering i haven't got my contacts in so i can't actually really see what i'm doing this morning i'm hoping this is okay on that note contacts update the nails have gone and i can get the contacts in and out without the long nails and i'm now going i've been taught a technique which has been approved by my optician which was from another woman that works at my opticians and um, she has very long nails literally like the length of how mine were and she showed me how she like safely gets hers in and out without like obviously scratching her eye so i'm gonna learn to do it that way hopefully i am now a contacts girly i am waiting for a new set of contacts to arrive I've, i'm on my last three hopefully some more will arrive this week but i'm literally rationing myself so i'm gonna wear my glasses today and then i think i'll wear my contacts tomorrow swede lash cloud mascara this is my favorite mascara anyway that is my little life catch up i hope you all had a lovely december break i spent mine obsessively playing hogwarts legacy i think ryan could tell i really needed a way to fully switch off and not work over christmas and that was a genius move on his part anyway i'm gonna get ready and i will check in with you when we are ready to leave okay we are in the car i've got everything i've got my snacks in my shoes <laughs> does anyone else do this when they're leaving the house you just shove things in random places because you're trying to get out of the house in time the sun is blinding i have never done this drive before so I'm not going to vlog on the way there at all because I need to be concentrating. It's going to be a lot of country roads, I think, and they stress me. So I will see you when we get to our destination. How many times did you just ring that bell? <laughs> 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 I've already stolen Susie's stuff. Yeah, it was literally, that was what I was going to run with. See. We're twins. Like, oh, these are like Audrey's ones. I was going to get Are they? Oh, great minds. Yeah, great, she is an icon. Me? Yeah, oh, please can you get these? No. They do. Oh, no, they do. Me and you like the same. That's why True. whenever I steal your sunglasses, True. it's like, oh, they suit you too. Yeah, you but you, but the, the Chanel ones look better on you, for sure. Oh, they're so cool. Yeah, I just love them. Oh, I was dressing Vic the other day via FaceTime, and I was like, you need oh, these so sunglasses. That. that was really good. I like that outfit. It looks so cute. Yeah, it's a bit different. I love them. Actually Wear them lower, lower down. I'm always saying this to you. Wear them lower down. I know, but then I literally... Yeah. Like Slay. I'm all about wearing them down, but that's really fast. Yeah. What about here? Better, yeah. Slay. Okay, yeah. Sold. Yeah, slay. I'm going to take these back because these were my hairband. Give us a room tour. No, I need sunglasses. Oh, that's too. nice. Okay, double sink vibes. Oh, we're in sea boots now. Oh, cute. Hey, wait, are these your photos? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. In my oh. video today, I literally said, I Twins. wonder if these come in black because I need that's them. That's so funny. And you're wearing them. Yeah. They're the best boots, they're so comfortable. I know! Like two hours and these yeah. would not get best as right Same, and I was like, yeah. oh, does it going to be black? So yeah. I think they're going to work. Oh, they great minds. They're such good boots, aren't they? They're brilliant boots. I love this, this colour too, though, I'm so mad. Yeah, that's a really nice colour for like when you want to do a camel winter vibe. Yeah. Or, oh. or a full black. With a leotard. Yeah, with a boot. This right. room tour is really room touring. <laughs> right, there is a shower and a box. Slay. 
Ooh. Ooh. Like, I'm, oh I my can God. also rely on you, by the way, Princess to bird. bring a giant ass bag. Thank I make you look so good. Much. Is this yours too? No, it's Vic's. Oh, why is there like a white oh, cell box in here? Ooh, oh, I don't know. What's she up to? Oh my God, she's brought my tin back. Oh, so oh, I make her yeah. gingerbread. <laughs> Every year for Christmas. I was like, why are there glossy in this Yeah, the only thing you can buy this woman that doesn't cost YSL prices. <laughs> the, these went within about a day and a half. Full, full tin of gingerbread. Oh, she loves so them. Thoughtful. I love them. Yeah. You got me more today. Now I'm going to play <laughs> No. My, no. <laughs> my baking days are gone. <laughs> Done for the year. Cheers, girls. Cheers. Cheers. Happy January. Is it Ooh. just tequila? Oh my gosh. Guys, this looks amazing. I've got foam in it. Gosh. I was going to Do you? That. Yeah, that looks really good. Oh no. Although, although mine look good too. It, it does look good. really nice. Does look good. Bon appetit. Thank you. Ooh, the fries. Over by me. <laughs> Where they belong. Just Thank kidding. So me and Amelia are sharing. Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. I did a really bad job of vlogging yesterday whenever i arrive somewhere it takes me like a few seconds to really kind of settle in and catch up and get my ducks in a row and just yeah i was very bad at vlogging yesterday but the aim for today is to not be that so the girls have gone down for breakfast ahead of me i just needed like five minutes to just exist and just get some spf on and like faff about a little bit i had a couple of margaritas last night and I'm so buffy. <laughs> but I actually didn't get to tell you where we are. We have come to the Four Seasons in Hampshire, which I I can't say Hampshire without sounding really wanky. Like it just comes out my mouth and it sounds like a different person is saying it. My accent completely switches for this one location apparently. And so I'm here with Vic and Amelia and we're just having a little girls trip it's so nice to catch up we didn't see we saw amelia last when we went to vista village before christmas and i haven't seen her since so it's just so nice to catch up and all be together oh i can see laura's doing the most we're trying to anyway i love it i love a girls trip so much so we have the full day here today we're ready for gym spa massages the whole shebang a little bit better i'm feeling slightly more human now so very quickly before i run down for breakfast this is my otd i've got my converse i was not getting multiple pairs of shoes in my suitcase i also brought brought my podcasting equipment so i just couldn't fit my gym shoes in so we're just making the converse work today i've got this Adenola set on, which is like a pine green. They don't do this color anymore, really sadly, but it's just the nicest, nicest color. And then I have this jumper on, which is really old PLT. I get asked about this the most, probably out of all of my sweatshirts. It's so nice, ridiculously oversized. Like this is just a small size, <laughs> super, super oversized. But I love it because it's got the greens and the oranges. And so I can wear it with a range of my active wear. So it's probably one of my most worn jumpers like it is bobbly it has probably seen better days but somehow i've managed to keep it white i mean touch wood it will stay white because now i've said that i feel like i'm gonna jinx it but anyway let's go for breakfast okay here we are where are the girls where are the girls where are the girls Hello. morning how are you I'm good how are you yeah yes <laughs> girls 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 i forgot to show you my coffee but just know that it was good a star Vic enjoyed her porridge I did. Amelia enjoyed her matcha. There we go. Oh, oh breakfast. My God. We're having that tomorrow. Jealous. You look so cute today. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. <laughs> Do the spa. Do the salon. I read that as gut health questionnaire. That sounds like yes. <laughs> so I am just in the waiting room. I'm about to have an inner peace massage. Me and Amelia are both having an inner peace massage, not the Gemini and the Libra. <laughs> trying to find inner peace. And Victoria is going for the lymphatic massage, I think. I really wanted to do that one, but I don't know. Last minute changed my mind to inner peace. Let's hope it works. <laughs> Girls who treadmill together. I was staring at the sweet oblivion there. <laughs> You've got a nice window in front of you. I've got a wall. I make bad choices. You two is first with that. Yeah. Well, I wanted space for you. Mission complete. 
this is how little we can touch our toes. We're competing to see who's the worst toe toucher. I don't know why I was showing up about this. <laughs> it's pretty embarrassing. Okay, ready? Go, ready, go. It was really nice. Massage done, gym done. We're now heading for lunch. This is like my dream morning. Woke up, had a coffee, had a massage. Went and did a 5K walk. If you haven't listened to episode one of the podcast by now, my goal is to do a 5K a day. Express how they get, but yeah, that is one of my goals at the moment. 5K a day. Healthy, healthy lunch. Delicious. It's finally happening. <laughs> Okay, podcast is over and out. We are done now. We are in our robes. We're getting ready. We're getting Are you excited? Outfit of the evening. I'm wearing this Reformation dress, which I think you guys will remember from like back in November. I bought this and it needs a little bit of altering. We've just literally pinned it at the sides just to make it a little bit shorter. And now it's really flattering on the legs. I'm super happy with that. I've got some sheer tights on and then I've got, I've got Victoria's YSL shoes on, which are just stunning. I love them. They're super like long on the toe. So they're just very elongating on the leg, which is lovely. I've also stolen her Bulgari serpenty bag thank you very much victoria for the loan and then i have really fun jewelry today this is a pair of my mom's earrings from these are my mom's from the 80s and i love them so much they're like a pearl and it's got like a navy frill around them i then got a monica vinida necklace on which you can adjust the chain length and i love that so it sits really nicely with this neckline i love the neckline on this it's really nice. Oh, we pinned this here as well because it needs altering there. And then I've just got my engagement ring, which funnily enough, I actually stole, I think the same day as I stole these off my mom when I was really, really little. And they've been in my jewelry box literally ever since. And then I've got a Monica Villada ring on. And that is pretty much it. So that's my outfit of the evening. Let's go. Been waiting to go for dinner for so long. Amelia's like, can we go now? Can we go down now? I'm like, oh, take your time. <laughs> Sexy later. Hannah and I will just be like, hey, sex me. Yeah, sex me. Oh my god, the hair. The hair is oh not look what to see look guys. Cool. What is no serious look happened? at look at this. Look at it. You know when you're just in a rush and you're disheveled. Perfect now. It's Thank perfect. you. Ooh, the loops. Sexual. I'm obsessed with the look fact that Amelia's way. heels are matching with her dress. Oh god, it's just you did the same thing that I just did to Vic. Yeah, <laughs> to really? me, it kicked your back so leg out. <laughs> Oh, you are a slave. Guys, everyone You're a slave. On their vlogs Absolutely. <laughs> Guys, I need these shoes and I need this bag. Like, this is my point of view right now. Is a sleigh. I'm so happy with it. This is behind the scenes of Amelia's TikTok. Okay. Not me, sitting with the bread. Vic was like, it's tempting me. I was like, take it away, take it away, out of my eyesight. So now I am the carb queen. <laughs> oh my God. That is the face of a happy girl. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Amazing. Thank you so much. Oh, this is so nice. Beautiful.
It's called skeleton oh lips. And when we serve it, whenever you're ready, we do like this. You see? No. So we finish one, and the other oh one God. stays. You can do the other oh as well. My you want to try that? Gosh, wait, stop. Can I do it on this side? You can. Doesn't matter. I feel like such an anarchist. I'm scared. <gasps> oh my god, wow. Do you want to do yours? This is like the most terrifying thing we've ever done. Watch it for us. Oh my god. So cool. Surely this didn't get signed off by Health and Safety. Oh my god, it smells so smoky! This is amazing! Cheers. Using our own uh, spirits. Um, wow! Oh, it's amazing! Did you say your own gin? Yeah. Wow! Oh my gosh! Okay, that's so really good! Find it <laughs> oh, that's still <laughs> That's so nice! Wow! Thank you! You guys, dinner last night was so good. I feel like this is the only place that I have vlogged. I wanted to show you my outfit of the day. So we've got this jumper from Cos. I'm gonna. I'm gonna bring you down. Jumper from Cos with white jeans. These are like, how do I even show you? These are a straight leg with a platform look. I'm obsessed. Mimi sunglasses, same necklace as last night. Monica Vinader earrings, all Monica Vinader. Monica Vinader ring. Louis. I think it's a vibe. And I'm very excited because I can wear my Mimi sunnies the whole way home today because your girl has contacts in. Amazing. Right, let's go for breakfast. A bit more of yeah. Hi. Hi baby, I'm your Auntie Suze. I'm babysitting you whilst your mum's in the bathroom. This would be a good fit in my wardrobe. Is anyone else just the most high maintenance driver? Like, I have had to change my shoes <laughs> before I start driving. I often have to make sure that I have some kind of glasses on, but not today. I, <laughs> I've got to find the gloves because otherwise I lose the feeling in my fingers. I've got to have the best playlist. I like to make sure I smell nice by the way. This is the best new fragrance i will link it i it literally dropped through my post box yesterday the girls have been loving it tom ford you have done it again so yeah i have to make sure my hands be warm my car has like the optimum temperature the playlist is right the sat nav is on because i don't know where i'm going ever i may be the closest of all of the girls to my house but i still don't know the route here so i've changed obviously as well so i fully changed <laughs> no i don't want to join le freud's jam what the hell is going on yeah like i have to do so many things before i can even set off in my car you've got to make sure the clip is nearby in case you need assistance whilst you're driving so many things sunglasses because uh is the sun gonna come out maybe maybe not oh i love these sunglasses ah! yes i am now on a post girl trip high so i am in suffering so I hope Ryan enjoys. Oh, that's another thing. Have to text Ryan to tell him that I'm on my way home because I like to do that so he can see. It's basically tidy the house in the time that it's taking me to leave. I think he that's why he likes for me to know. So he's like, let me know when you're leaving. I'm like, you want to do the washing up really last minute, don't you? I'm not sure what I'm going to do the rest of this afternoon, to be honest, because my plans have been cancelled. So the rest of this vlog is truly TBC. Oh, my seatbelt's already on. <laughs> I feel really far away. I think the people have moved my seat back. Is this, is this better? Anyway, I'm gonna love you and leave you because like, you're balanced so precariously and this is not this is not an acceptable driving standard. So I'll see you when we get home. Love you, bye. What are you beeping at me for? Remote control key, please change battery. Oh, I'm gonna have anxiety the whole way home. Oh my God. Shrimpy! 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 <laughs> Shrimpy! <laughs> Oh, my baby, I'm home. I missed you ever so much. Hello. Hello, gorgeous girl. Oh, you're feral. There's no collar on. Oh, no. Has daddy been giving you a brush? Oh, lovely. Loves a belly. Look at, look at the hand. Look at the hand. The, the paw. The paw means lower. Lower. <laughs> oh, I missed you. I missed you so much. Good evening. <laughs> 
I have been for a walk and done my nails and now I'm in the bathroom, I'm hair masking. I'm using the L'Oreal Elvive Bond Repair hair mask. I really like that one. I've run out of the shampoo and conditioner and I'm very sad about it. I am having some beauty TLC time as per one of my new year goals that I talked about in my podcast, which hopefully, hopefully should be out right now. You can go and listen to it. One of my goals this year is to make more time for myself because I ended up saying yes to everything so much at the end of last year, which is good. Like going to things is good, working more is good, all of that is good. But I ended up just not having time to look presentable and I went to things and I felt bad about myself and it almost felt counterproductive of going to things because I didn't feel like I was being my best self. So now for every thing, every meeting, every situation in my calendar that I would ideally look good for, the evening before that, it has to be clear. It has to be clear. And I have meetings tomorrow and I want to look good. I've got a full London day. We are bleaching the moustache, we are hair masking, we're about to shower, I'm going to tan after that. I'm going to use my express mousse. This one I actually, I, it's okay, it's okay with me in the summer but the winter it bangs. It I love it. That's my go-to winter tan purity gel and whipped mousse in the summer, that in the winter, love. Gonna pop that on for literally three hours. It develops so fast. Like I actually find most of them, I don't see a color change until like the eight hours of actual development time are up. You have your on skin time and then you have development time. And I don't normally find I see a difference until eight hours with a lot of the saint Pay ones. But that one I actually see a difference with by the time I'm like washing it off, which is wild. But only in the winter for some reason. I think it likes a drier skin. Not sure. That could be wrong. I don't know. But it just works really quickly on me in the winter. Anyway, my upper lip is burning. <laughs> I think I need to remove this now. The dark hair girlies will understand. If this isn't something you have to do in life, I'm so jealous of you. But I literally get bullied on the internet if I don't do it, so don't don't say you could choose not to do it because I <laughs> don't enjoy being bullied. However, the last month, this has been the first month in a very long time that no one has commented on my mustache. So thank you to all of you. I really appreciated that. So that's done. I'm gonna jump in the shower and this is where I'm going to leave it for this vlog. I really hope you enjoyed coming along with me on my girls trip into the spa. I feel so re-energized for that whole trip. Like girl time, so nice. Spa time, so nice. Honestly, it's just, it's been so good. I'm so excited that we filmed a girly episode of the podcast as well. That will not be the one that's live right now, but that will be next Wednesday's episode. They're gonna go up on a Wednesday morning. But yeah, it feels so good to be back. So good to be back on the podcast. So good to be back on YouTube. This is my second video back of the year and I'm loving it. I'm glad I took a long Christmas break. I feel so re-energized. So yeah, thank you so much for joining me this week and I will see you guys again hopefully on Sunday. We've got a lot of stuff to do in the next vlog, but until then, love you, bye.